Hi everyone, I'm Longo. What we do is tailor rehabilitation for patients. If they have to do rehabilitation at home, we make it a quality, as the one in the medical center. Nowadays, every developing <coughs> country facing three very important challenges, and that is aging, aging, and aging. They cause the number of patients increase. They cause the number of disabled people increase, but the clinical resource is very, very limited. They also make that we have patient to be done by doctor or by physiotherapist, now shipped to the patient themselves or to the caregiver. The requirements of, of medical professional never reduced, but the supply of medical professional is decreased uh, badly. As we can see here, it's totally different. So what we do? What we do is to balance this gap. What we do is to empower the medical professional to the caregiver or to the patient themselves. Let them control their, their rehabilitation by using our device. How do we do that? We just turn the medical professional into a product. In hospital, there is a variety of training programs for them to do therapeutic issue or to do diagnosis. For diagnosis, it's just like to measure the severity of their stroke or to help them to improve the function of the limb or, or their balance. So um, what we really do is, uh, to, since it's a product and easy to scale and easy to spread to global wise, it is a, a compact all-in-one 3D sensor and has some uh, easy to use. Uh, patient just bring this back home, connect to their PC and start to work. And what is our earning model? We sell the system to hospital and we rent this one to patient themselves. So currently we have still, uh, we have a uh, fifty more than fifty percent of the medical center in Taiwan they buy our system and our uh, price is uh, increased eight thousand percent times. So uh, all those medical centers they buy our system now become our hub to spray our system to their uh, all patients so far. So uh, what we do next is to, to duplicate our current business model to the end of the world. For us, the end of the world is including Japan, North European, and California. So we need the, to raise the 3 million US dollars to the marketing. So our team composed of many experts with a variety of uh, medical proficiency, and we have managed team here. So we got investors from Taiwanese governor and also got uh, exposure to important uh, media in Taiwan. Thank you. A bit more business model, I mean, revenue model. Yeah, it's revenue hardware. model? Yeah, yeah. hardware. It's a, it's a compact all in one hardware, software, and the cloud system. Cloud system for the diagnosis. So, fast hospital is easy, it's just a sale out. And uh, for, uh, for, for patients, they need to do uh, rehabilitation at home. Rental is uh, monthly, it's uh, 200 US dollars. But we have a nice uh, physical therapist at the hospital. Rental from hospital. Rental from hospital? Uh, directly from us. From us to see directly. Yep. Do you need specific hard hardware? It's you know, what, what you think that's hardware? Yeah. yeah. It's a it's a mechanism, it's a 3D sensing. It's more like a connect, but we have our own uh, solution that we can now achieve our sensor modules and everything together to make it a, a product. Combined so, together. So, so, uh, uh, to capture how patients do the rehabilitation, and then you do kind of recommend how, how yeah, okay. should be improved yeah. or kind of uh, Your answer should be that uh, how could we just uh, benefit the, the yeah. patient? Yeah, there's, uh, we have, uh, there's a lot of uh, training program that will make the software to guide them how to do that. Just like balance training or everything, that is, uh, should be done to, to be demoed by the physiotherapist <coughs> in the hospital. When, when, when down, now it's done by, by the software, and the system itself can measure your body's uh, vital sign, heart rate, uh, heart rate, or some 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 breathing rate, and your body's response uh, content lasting. Can it be more like an only software service side, not like lending the hardware yeah, to, right. yeah. to reduce down its energy barrier for patient? Yes, uh, uh, if the, the, the number is uh, number of hardware is increased, of course the price will reduce better. Yeah. But still, hardware is important for patients.
uh, so far it is because we are now just uh, focusing on Taiwan. So as a, the number is a, as a, as a limited. Yeah, but uh, our value and, uh, and our uh, how do I say our strength is uh, the software. This is what we are doing best. The software is uh, this is videos, right? Certainly videos, and, uh, and then of course data collection. Yeah, I would say it is a uh, it is uh, uh, more like uh, uh, interactive training to to visualize the, the job that is done by visual therapists, and of course I will acquire and analyze the data to get then the the condition evaluation. So just walk me through. Uh, so assume I need to go for rehab and I'm and I'm at home. I've got one of these equipment. Am I supposed to place this in front of me while I watch a TV, TV, whatever the video of what I'm supposed to do, and then I will have the Wi-Fi to connect and somehow the information of how I've moved uh, will be captured. Do I need to wear any other devices? Yes. Sir. Uh, first of all, thank you for your question. Second is that you are too too young and too healthy for using our system. So uh, for, for the user's experience, we don't ask them to wear anything because uh, some patient for us, our patient is uh, first uh, overlap to the elderly people. They resist to wear anything uh, based on our experience. So for them, they just uh, watch the TV. They, the TV will watch them as well. So guide them what to do. They have, we have a nice, uh, we have a physical therapist online to give them the prescription of today or the, the week. And they just follow the, they do the homework and then the, the condition will get improved. How much does this cost? What is the average spend? How much are they, how much is an average patient spending? The price? Yeah. Yeah, as I mentioned, if it's a rental, it is uh, not, not a price. This price is a 200 US dollar in Taiwan. So one price, this, just one price a month? Yeah, monthly. So the idea is that this thing will be returned to the hospital once I am uh, discharged from my rehab, from the rehab program. Yes. And so I will have to mount this, this, this device on top of the TV so that as I sit in front, it gets, it captures my movement. Yes. Okay, very good. Yes. And we see that it is, uh, we are focused on the, some, some elder disease, just like stroke or Parkinson or some dementia or some replacement of your organ. So take an American stroke patient, for example, there's a 4 million uh, patient yearly. And uh, if they pay, everyone pays just 200 US dollars. And so the yearly income is supposed to be 10 million US dollars. And uh, this is uh, what we are focused on. So this year we will go to America for three years for the marketing expansion. Thank you.